You've got one end that connects to an outlet on your RV. You've got the other end is just gonna connect to a sewer input in the ground. In this video, I'll give you a straight to the point tutorial on how to hook up your RV sewer at the campground. If you're looking for a more detailed explanation, check the link in the description to another video where I walk you through step by step and explain each step to you. But this video is straight to the point on how to hook up your RV sewer at the campground. Let's get right to it. Because you're dealing with things you don't want on your hands, I have, uh, some people use disposable gloves. I have the same pair of gloves I always use and I just don't use it for other things. You've just got um, teeth here that are gonna connect onto the end of your tube so that they lock in. Now on the other end, you wanna secure it. So the pipe that's in the ground actually has threading on it. So you're gonna thread this adapter into that threading and then your hose actually goes here. into here and, and it's secure, it's not gonna come out. You want to make sure that you've got it set up that you're not making water go uphill. There's a tool for that too. It's like, a, um, it's like an accordion. You lay your hose down in and you can adjust, you can turn, um, you can have higher sections and lower sections. You've got waste from the commode, you gotta empty that. And then you've got uh, water from the showers and the sinks and you're gonna empty that second, and it's gonna wash out anything that's, uh, that's in the line. You've got a couple of valves. This is the valve for your black tank from your toilet. It's easy, you pull it and it starts coming here. So I'm gonna pull this. Immediately it starts coming through here. And it's going now through the hose all the way down where we put it into the ground and it's going into the sewer. Once it's done, you're gonna close it back up. You're now gonna use the other tanks to flush out the line. I'm just gonna open my next one. That's my gray tank. It's now flushing out the line and anything that didn't go all the way down is now getting flushed out from shower water and bathroom sink water. So this is what it should look like on the other end. You've got a, a strong seal. You can see uh, what's coming through. This is just gray tank coming through and there's nothing leaking out. If something's leaking out, just go stop the, um, just go close the valve, fix, adjust, get it like it needs to be, and then open it back up and finish what you're doing. 